Hey guys, I'm making this video to say yes, you could use the video game cows as a memory cow. It is possible. Um, so yeah. So you can see here, I've got a, um, a slot, so I'm just going to put the game card in. But before I put the game card in, I'm going to stop the video show, okay? X out, and if your game card supports it, you have a directory called GL00, right, which is read only, but you have another one called GLW0, and this one is actually read dash right. So basically, I can do I can do stuff with this. So like I can go grab some homebrew, for example. I could go grab this copy of Sappy Bird. All right, and I could copy it. Alright, and I can put it into GLW0. Paste. Alright, and now it's on the game tab, right? So if I take out this game tab, so you can see GLW0 is now gone. I could now give this to my friends, and they could go actually install that game, that um, homebrew, which is pretty cool. But I don't have any friends, so I'm just gonna put it straight back in. Which is actually really difficult to do. Um, now, if you're expecting to put any garage files in this, don't. It will only give you about, at most, like, 2 megabytes or something. But, it is cool if we could mount a GLO0, or we could get one that has a huge GLW0 partition. This could be pretty cool, so we could use this as like a memory card in a way. But anyway, you can see Sippy Bird it's right there. I can I can even install it straight from the game card. So yeah, I can just do that if I wanted. But yeah, anyway, I just wanted to show about if it could be done. You could use this as like a USB stick or something for PS Vita, but whatever. Um, as long as you don't yet, yeah, of course, install the game because it will only be tied to your account and you'll. Find the problem, so yeah, I'm just gonna take that out, and yeah, it could be done.